I can help you? Yeah, I have an overnight letter here for Jeffrey Wyatt. It needs a signature. Okay, um, wait here. I'll go get him. Hi. Can I help you? Yeah, could you please just get Jeffrey Wyatt? Sure. Hi. Can I help you? You're very funny. You're hysterical. I need to see Jeffrey Wyatt. Can you get him? Can you do that? No prob. A little too much coffee this morning? Hello. Can I help you? I need to see Jeffrey Wyatt. I'll get him right away. sign this? Could you do me that favor and sign that? Just sign Jeffrey Wyatt. That's it. Jeffrey. Right. Good. This is your package. Well, that's it. This is my last delivery. The Wyatts. I'll remember this. This is going into my book. I'll never forget this family. The comedian family here. Unbelievable. I'm getting... I'm going back to school. My goodness. He was absolutely insane. I know. But he's kind of cute. Lisa! Where'd he go? Somebody say there was a messenger here oh. for me? Hey, Dad, what was that big deal letter about? From a lawyer in Hawaii. Something to do with Aunt Sylvia's estate. Hmm. Jess, have you seen my new sweater? Well, Lisa, oh, I should have known. She didn't even put it back. Well, I think she washed it for you. She better not have put it in the dryer. Well, the bonding process between stepdaughter and stepmother should begin well before the wedding. If that bond is not established before the wedding, or very soon after, the relationship could be damaged beyond repair. Beyond repair? Hi. Oh, you startled me. Oh, what are you reading? Oh, just tips on the wedding. Oh, are you nervous? Petrified. <laughs> well, so, how, how's everything? Fine. Um, oh, have you seen my striped scarf? Oh, I haven't. But I could help you look. Or, or lend you mine. Or we could run down to the store and get another. I'll just run my polka dot one. Oh. Hello? Yes, this is she. Oh, flight change? 311, Honolulu. Uh, the wedding's in... Two days. <sighs> Petrified. OK, that's it for now. But I got to go to the fabric store. I'll be right back. Bye, Susie. Bye, Karen. Thanks. Bye, girls. Bye, Sharon. Megan's looking for you. And what you told her about the sweater? What did you tell yeah, her Ben Milton, please. Look at this. Oh, Mr. Milton, Jeffrey Wyatt. With two fingers mittens. Fine, fine. Yeah, I got your letter. Look, Lisa, this is the last time I'm going to say this. Uh, I'm, I'm sorry, I can't hear you. No, we, we have a good connection, is it? Girls! Oh, give it a rest. Yeah, well, I, I, was, I was a bit curious you about... You uh, we're sorry. Okay? I'm sorry you knocked on me. Oh, yeah, I didn't well, knock on, on you! Jesse, please, hold it down. Why are you yelling at me? I didn't do anything. It's those guys. They can't say two words without putting me in the middle. Hey, honey, honey, come here. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to snap, okay? I'm sorry, uh, Mr. Milton. Right, and you were... What was that? Ladies of the Wyatt family, we have just inherited a hotel. Uh-uh-uh. In Hawaii. What? No way. <laughs> really? Aunt Sylvia's? I've told you all about it. It is the most beautiful place. It's all done in plantation style, with these wide-open porches and manicured lawns, and it's right off the ocean with its own private beach. Jeffrey. Well, let's go now. Go. Now. <clears throat> well, we own it, right? So we don't have to pay for our rooms. And you could do that hula dance, the one you won all those trophies for. Yeah. <laughs> Listen, girls, 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 we'd all like to just jump on a plane and go now, but, uh, uh... Actually, we are stopping in Hawaii on our way to Australia. Well, I'll tell you what. We'll talk about it. We'll talk about it. Heard that before. World's longest way of saying no. 
Oh, Jeffrey. What? They seemed so disappointed. Oh, we'll go eventually, as soon as we all get some time together. But they're going to be fine. In two hours from now, they'll be on to something else. No, but you see, I don't want them to think that I'm the kind of person who doesn't listen. No. No. You see, I've read, heard, that it's important to bond, to spend time together, you know? I think you're absolutely right. And we have the rest of our lives. And you can start right after the honeymoon. Hmm? Might as well forget it. The only way we're going to see that hotel is if we inherit it. Too bad, because I think Susan wanted to take us. I know she wanted to take us. I've seen what she's been reading these days, and it's a first-class ticket to paradise. Oh, I know. I should have said more. No, it's not you. You have been great. It's just, well, when I thought we could all go to Hawaii together, yeah. it felt really great, you know? Uh, a family type of a thing. Mm. You know, we, we've never really done that. Mm. You know, it just depressed me, the way Dad just tossed it off. Anyways, I, I don't know how Megan and Jesse feel, but, well, do you kind of... I'll talk to your father. Well, if you want. Yeah. Watch it. Oh, Jeffrey. It's our honeymoon. You don't take kids on your honeymoon. No, the trellis goes on the other side. But it's not really our honeymoon until Australia. Did you order this size table? The girls want to be with us so badly. Much as I know they love us, I think this has more to do with Hawaii. But of course it has. I mean, you've told them for years about this hotel and the wonderful summers you've had there. I mean, why wouldn't they be dying to see it? Okay. Look, honey, I think the sentiment is fine. Just give me two. In fact, it's more than fine. It, is this all the chairs that we ordered? But this is supposed to be our time, you see? And if we're constantly having to keep our eyes on the girls... Excuse me, I think we ordered more chairs. Oh, we must have. Maybe this isn't our order. Weiler? Susan, do you take Jeffrey to be your lawfully wedded husband, to have and to hold until death do you part? I do. I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss the bride. Oh. <laughs> Any news on the travel front? Well, not yet. I knew this wouldn't work. <sighs> and Sharon said she'd join us after a few days. What? And then we'd have a little time on our own in Hawaii. And she could keep an eye on the girls mm -hmm. when we're in Australia. Pretty good idea, don't you think? Well, smile. admit bringing the girls was a pretty good idea of mine. Yours? Yeah. <laughs> oh, it'll be wonderful. Spend some time together, really get to know each other as a family. Postcards. Girls? Gotta get my board. Lisa? 